hi guys you are welcome to my youtube channel uh today we'll be looking at how we can scan boom and crash index on the lower time frame but before we do that we are going to look at the daily the higher time frames uh and see what has happened uh, uh this boom 1000 index and on the daily time frame price is going up okay look at the last three daily candles these are three long candles and that shows the momentum the strong momentum and we might see price going as high as at uh, this point 10 512 might see price getting to 10 512 area so um boom 1000 is bullish for the daily time frame uh that started from the uh inverted and should show that breakout around uh this point okay so um on the four hour time frame uh boom 1000 index let's look at what has happened on the four hour time frame on the four hour time frame uh we have a bullish run okay not much uh, so, uh resistance from the uh, bears okay the bears were able to resist a bit here and you can see uh on the four hour time frame a bit of resistance around there from the bears but the bulls are in charge okay let's look at the one hour time frame what we have uh is a bullish run keep the price keeps establishing higher highs okay look for buy opportunities only for now on boom 1000 if you are going to buy let's look at the drawdown we are buying on the one hour time frame let's look at the drawdown okay okay it's about the same drawdown so if you place your buy here your stop loss should be somewhere around here okay so that's that for the one hour time frame boom 1000 index uh 30 minutes time frame also also shows a bullish momentum just look for buying opportunities look at the candle that just formed uh the bears were trying to retrace but look at the bulls are not taking chances they are stepping in as soon as the bears push price down look at look at the spikes keeps happening this is the 15 minutes time frame keeps spiking spiking after some retracement a test of the trend line it spikes retrace to the trend line tests spikes so five minutes time frame boom 1000 we are range the price is ranging for now but if it drops to this area I expect some spike okay on the one minute time frame look at look at we just spike now boom so look for buying opportunities on boom 1000 index that's boom 1000 index for you uh let's look at uh, crash 1000 crash 1000 is also buying uh it's also buying look at the daily time frame just buying and buying and buying so, okay we have a range price is, uh, is ranging on the daily time frame i was initially expecting a double top okay i was expecting a double top okay but uh price did not really go to the neckline this was supposed to be the neckline okay but price didn't get to it and look at this engulfing bar and price starts to go up so we expect a break above this point and expect price to continue to go up but this crash 1000 index or the daily time frame uh we might be looking at this high okay so that's crash 1000 on the daily time frame. let's look at the four hour time frame what let's look at the four hour time frame on the four hour time frame we can see the bullish run okay uh where price keeps establishing higher low higher low higher low higher low higher high higher high higher low okay so we'll be expecting a break of this particular structure around here if price breaks the structure then the bullish trend continues but for now price is ranging on the four hour time frame let's look at the one hour time frame on one hour time frame we can see the range okay like a triangle okay price is forming a triangle on the one hour time frame so you might expect it to test the triangle the top at here then bounce down test up time bounce down until we have a breakout to the top okay but for now crash 1000 is buying for buying opportunities on the one hour time frame okay this uh, 30 minutes time frame you can see you can see what's happening heading for the top heading for the top okay this there's a particular other block around here that price is targeting you might get to the other block and then drop okay let's try and see the other block this particular other block uh might serve as resistance to price okay i'm looking at the six five four three area 
Okay, but for now, look for buying opportunities on the 15 minutes time frame. Crash 1000 index is buying. It's buying. The buyers are in charge. The buyers and the charge and few, just few or tiny spikes. Okay, okay, we have a reasonable spike around here. But look at all the 15 minutes time frame. It may be the spike, but it just fizzes out and price that to go. Okay, so look for buying opportunities. Uh, look for buying opportunities. Five minutes time frame. You can see one two three four just four or five spikes and the rest is just going up right just going up forming green blocks one minute time frame look at the spike here but the green block is already validating that uh structure look at breaking of the structure already so look for buying opportunities for crash 1000 index okay on the smaller time frames let's look at boom 1000 index this is the daily time frame and price is also bullish okay price is bullish and we have a bullish structure in place and it is respected but just like crash 1000 boom 1000 index also ranging i was expecting a double top uh on uh boom one of uh, boom 500 i was expecting a double top this is the first top uh this is the second top uh, this is the second top okay uh i was expecting a double top but we do not have that that's not working out as this particular uh pin bar is trying to push price up okay we might see price heading to the top but we are in a range for now on the daily time frame price is ranging okay this is the range top and the range top and then the range bottom okay we are in a range let's see what happens let's look at the four hour time frame it's ranging you can see ranging price is ranging okay um let's look at one hour time frames also ranging but ranging up okay it's ranging up as we have higher 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 high higher low higher high higher low so it's ranging up uh, let's look at 30 minutes time frame it's also ranging ranging up okay but we we expect it to go up uh, as we expect it to start to spike up look at this small spike here it might start to spike up or it might drop down to this particular point and then start to spike up okay the overall structure is still bullish on the daily time frame let's look at the 15 minutes time frame what do we have on the 15 minutes time frame uh with bullish okay look at this forming a bottom at this resist at this support area already testing this support area and it's forming a bottom on it so you might expect to buy boom one boom 500 index let's look at the five minutes time frame okay on the five minutes time frame it's quite kind of tricky we have a descending trend line that has just been broken okay you expect it to retest and then start to spike until you start to see the spike on the five minutes time frame do not engage do not buy until you start to see uh the spikes as soon as you start to see the spikes then you start to buy okay and it's quite tricky on the one minute time frame okay you can see the validation of the descending trend line okay so we expect the uh price to respect this ascending trend line once it gets to this uh ascending trend line we expect it to spike up or at worst it drops down to the trend line trend line around here and then spike up but the moment price drops below and breaks this structure if price break this particular structure here then don't buy for now and look for selling opportunities land for boom 500 index uh, lastly, let's look at uh, crash 500 index. Okay, let's look at crash 500 index on the daily time frame. We can see that crash 500 index on the daily time frame. We have a range on the daily time frame. Price is ranging. That's the range uh, top, and this is the range uh, bottom. Okay, these are range bottom. Until we see a breakout of this range, we continue to range traders should continue to, you know you you work with the range okay uh that's for the daily time frame for the four hour time frame crash 500 index four hours let's look at what's happening on the four hour time frame okay on the four hour time frame we can see price respecting the range top and the range bottom okay so for now we more like having a double bottom and price if price breaks this trend line around here okay it's already currently being broken I see it going back to the top of the range. Okay, that's that on the four hour time frame. On the one hour time frame, we can see price breaking uh descending trend line. Okay, we also have another trend line around here. 
that price is respected. So we expect price to go up for now on the uh, one hour time frame. Let's look at the 30 minutes time frame. Uh, price is respecting the ascending trend line. That means price is going up. But we have a range on the 30 minutes time frame. Look at, look at this range. Okay. These are arranged up on 30 minutes time frame. And these are arranged uh, bottom on the 30 minutes time frame. So a break of the range top, we see price going up. Okay, on the 15 minutes time frame, what do we have? On the 15 minutes time frame, we can see uh, price is also ranging. Okay, on the five minutes time frame, is there anything is still ranging on the five minutes time frame? So wait for the range breakout before you engage. Wait for the range breakout before you engage, whether you want to buy or you want to sell. Okay, on the one minute time frame, still ranging still ranging the buyers and the sellers they are happy with one another it's like an equilibrium wait for the rain breakout before you again all right that's that for our analysis on how to scalp boom 1000 and boom our, our analysis on how to scalp boom and crash index are uh, you if, if you are yet to subscribe to the channel go ahead and click the subscribe button you can like the video uh you can also drop comment ask questions below the video uh, click the bell button below the video for notification. You can visit our website www.bnfxtrader.com to learn more on how to trade. To learn more on how to trade boom and crash in it. You can also visit another website of us fxfables.com to learn more on how to trade uh, boom and crash in Till I come your way next time. It's bye for now.